You may be a newly enrolled presidential student ambassador, but you're nervous for what's ahead of you. You may be wondering, what could I possibly learn from a PSA course? Well, this course might spark your interest more than you first imagined. Today, I will share information about the first PSA course. There are prerequisites that you are expected to complete shortly before or during the course. You are expected to complete 40 hours of volunteering, and these hours must be logged through ISERV. Since I took the PSA course in the fall, I completed the majority of my hours beginning in June. It was much easier to get it out of the way than to worry about it throughout the semester. During the course, you also get opportunities to earn volunteer hours by simply completing a closed captioning review of PSA YouTube videos. During the course, you're expected to compose and complete speeches that will be beneficial to other students. Throughout the first semester, you are tasked with composing four speeches. The topics range from tutorials to advice for your fellow peers. And the last speech, which is the fourth speech, is a face-to-face -face before the class and possibly invited guests. This is based on how you have grown as a leader. Throughout the first semester course, you will be visited by various guest speakers. These guest speakers range from present WVU administrators, faculty, and staff to WVU alumni who have made a name for themselves. These guests are the highlight of the experience as a PSA. While getting to learn their leadership journey, you also get to form connections with individuals who are experienced at fields you want to go into. One of the guest speakers was an employee at Disney who played a major role in leading projects such as the Disney Cruise and the theme parks. Another guest was from the Morgantown Police Department who informed us about shooting protocol and various situations he has been in. These are only two of many incredible guest speakers that visited our classroom with various stories and experiences to share. In addition to many stories from incredible people, we also had lunch day with President Guy, where we go ask him questions and learn about his experiences. I hope now you're more prepared for what's ahead of you and even more eager to embrace the title. I understand that the Presidential Student Ambassador title can seem like a heavy title, but ultimately, it's a journey of growth and friendship. The connections and friends you make along the way is what truly matters. So in the coming semester, foster those memories and use them to guide, it, guide you in your journey.